but I spoke to the owner of the Range Cafe. Now, this location on Manal is one of three that they have had to close down. And well, he says another shutdown would just be too much to handle. Like many businesses to survive in this pandemic, the owner of the Range Cafe says they've made a lot of changes. We have people that do nothing but disinfect all day, you know, separating the tables, kind of reorganizing our dining rooms. But as COVID cases rise drastically in New Mexico, some question, is that enough? Especially following this warning from the governor Thursday. If I don't see based on, again, the data, that turning around, I won't have any other choice. Right now, Matt DeGregory is preparing for the worst, another shutdown or greater restrictions. In the back of our minds, we're all kind of going, we're expecting at any moment. It's going to be devastating. I, I don't see how we make it out of the next shutdown. Devastating because he says they're out of PPP money and there's no more loan forgiveness. So as a member of the Restaurant Association, he and others are coming up with ways to keep their doors open of what we can do with our HVAC systems or f possible filtration systems or heavy duty sanitizers. We're looking at all those options of what we can do above and beyond to make the governor feel safe about allowing us to remain open. His hope is that they can find a way to stay open at at least 25% capacity. At 25% capacity, we can get by, you know, we can scrape it together. Now the owner says that they can't survive on just to go order. So if there is another shutdown, that'll likely mean for them closing more restaurants permanently. Reporting live in Albuquerque, Kayla Norwood, KOAT Action 7 News. The Range Cafe has been in New Mexico for nearly 30 years.